Hey, so I've had a few questions about the CTK AMI website. So I thought I'd go ahead and make a little presentation kind of to walk y'all through and show you where everything is right now. Y'all have been doing so great helping your kids. Thank you so much for everything you're doing. I know it's been a lot and we are learning as we're going and I am here. So email me all you need to. I will get back to you. I will do everything I can to help y'all. So. As y'all know, you go to fifth, the fifth grade sim. It's got all of our awesome plans. Each week is laid out individually. So here we go. We already got this week's, um, our fourth week, starting on day 16. If you are looking for what we call the special forces, so that's art, music, PE, computer, Spanish, you're going to come up over here to the special forces tab. And you scroll down to find each topic. So this is divided by subject. So here we have all of art. If I open it up, you'll have to scroll down until we find fifth grade art. So here's third grade, fourth grade. Here we are fifth grade, week one, week two, and week three. Um, I believe we are on week two for art. And Miss Friend has actually created and added everyone to Google Classrooms so that you can submit everything as pictures on there. Um, you've also got your computer assignments, music, PE, and Spanish. So they are by grade for there. So you have to look for fifth grades. And you'll see they've included links and everything to help you with that. We've also got the online library source. It has created. So you can look at all these different things. You can open this link. I'm sorry. Go to the virtual library. Look at that. So you can look at different books and things if you want to read, Scholastic, Audible Stories, different resources you can use to find books. If these don't work, you can also use our local Central Arkansas library system and download online books there. Also go to the homepage for online textbooks, Religion. I have this link in our Google Classroom as well. See, um, science. Your student would use the, your Google ID and their Google password, which is in their assignment pad. Now, y'all have the science book at home as well now, so you don't have to use the online one. But if they, if y'all want to, you can. They've got extra practice and things on there. That's always handy. Social studies and math are also out there. All right, I've included all of the links to the different web um, online books that we use in our class in Google Classroom as well. Um, if you'll have questions, let me know.